Hey guys, it's Kate and welcome to my Brandy Melville clothing haul. Welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new. Today, as you've seen in the title, I'm going to be doing Brandy Melville hugest, biggest haul you've ever seen or something like that. I don't know what I titled it yet, but here we are. I got all this clothes cumulatively during the summer. I work at Brandy, so after every single shift, I bought more than what I made from my little minimum wage of $10 an hour. So, um, it's going to be a very big haul. Don't skip the ads on this so that um, hopefully this amounted to something and hopefully you're entertained because I don't need this much clothes but I just can't stop myself. So pretty much all of this is for me except I think a few items are for friends as gifts just because like I don't know I like buying stuff for people because it makes me happy so yeah. This shirt just says um, heaven sent and it's like a little angel and I also got the exact same thing in this purple color but I think I might give this one out as a gift just like a little crop top baseball tee style and it is a little bit tight around here which like it absorbs all your armpit sweat if you have some which isn't ideal but it's so cute you know since I'm really into basics now I just got this like simple little white waffle t-shirt and it has like a little bit of a lace here and it has like little ruffly hem and details too and since this video is not sponsored you can shop my jewelry at purchasebykate.com I have a bad habit of buying clothes that I'm not realistically going to wear so I'm trying to get myself to buy more like t-shirts like ones that I've been showing you guys because that's what I realistically wear but I don't usually buy a lot of them just because they're not as fun you know I told myself I was not going to buy this shirt but now I have three of these I've got white and I've got pink and the reason why I didn't want to buy these is because Literally everyone has a shirt in this style because Brandy's basic and I guess I'm really basic now too. This shirt, I think it's like alright. Like my arms don't look that good in it, but that's okay. I really like the graphic, so I had to get it. It's like these two little girls <laughs> whispering to each other. I think that's so cute. So I had to get it. And it's a little bit cropped, but not too much if you wear high pants that you pull up. I'm not sure what was going in my head when I decided to buy this. Okay, so basically it's just like a simple white tank top. I guess I thought that I wanted to get more into basics, which is true. So it has like a little scalloped edge. Ooh, and this is gonna look so good with jewelry. Like you can like layer whatever you want. Just in this video, I didn't really want to wear a lot because I'm pulling clothes off constantly and I don't want to rip something up, you know? I love tops that you can tuck in and it almost looks like a bodysuit because I don't actually want to wear a bodysuit because it is so annoying when you have to use the bathroom. Now this is a top that just doesn't feel like me, but I like that it's like that. I'm someone who doesn't really have a style. I'll wear literally anything because I just like to try stuff out. I just really like how I feel like somebody else in this and it's kind of cool. So I never used to like the color black on me because I just feel like my hair blends right into it. So I've always kind of envied blonde people or just people with lighter hair in general because as you can see, like you can't see. I mean, it's, there's like no difference right here. Just, goes right in but I decided that I'm just gonna start wearing black again for no reason nobody even cared but yeah I'm just telling you now um, I really like this top so much it is so nice and form-fitting but like super stretchy at the same time and oh sorry I lost my balance there and oh you can't see because it's so black this is the exact same thing as the black shirt that I showed you well that I was having trouble showing you the wrappy stuff here but this is just the white version and a tank top version Ooh, it's a graphic. You know, for how many graphics and really cute graphics that Brandy has, I would expect myself to have bought more. But this is actually the only graphic short sleeve. This one says uh, Chinatown, and then there's like a dragon, and it's really sick because I am Chinese, and I go to Chinatown a lot too, even though it smells kind of bad here, but the food's good, and that's where my homies are at, so I love wrapping this. So everyone at work wears biker shorts with their oversized t-shirts. I thought they looked cute, so I bought some too. But like, I don't know how I feel about this. Like from here, it, it looks pretty okay, right? But then when you pull it down, is it because I'm too short? I don't know. Please comment down below like what I should do. If I'm wearing them wrong, or if I'm just like not used to seeing myself in this, or if I should just stop with the biker shorts because I don't know, this looks kind of weird. Ooh, trying this on makes me even happier that I bought this. 
because now we're moving on to the long sleeve section which I don't have a lot of because I live in Hawaii and it's way too hot here to wear long sleeves except for like one month in like January or February where it's finally cold so this shirt has like that really nice like boxy drapey feel and I really like the material it's actually light so maybe I'll be able to wear it even when it's hot outside I don't know if I'm in the AC all day then I can the sleeves obviously are very long I might just cut it since this is a raw hem why not just make the sleeve a raw hem too my fabric scissors and Max is here too so yeah. someone just commented today that you're really hot oh thank you <laughs> I have to say holy though I, I sent them here hey Instagram. one what? Bible distance away okay you stay away we can't be safe don't cut yourself. I'm trying to cut my shirt because it's a little bit long. Do you see the sleeve? Like that. You can just fold it over. That's what my mom does. Now nah, we're going to cut it because right here is cut, you know? So I feel like I can just cut it. Yeah. Isn't it going to roll over though? Roll over. That's a look. Oh, I kind of like it. It looks really good. Is it still a little long? It kind of is, yeah. Okay, yeah. I'm just going to deal with that later. <laughs> Max saw this like peeking out. He thought it was trying on underwear for everyone, but this is a tank top from Hollister. <laughs> we have this humongous <laughs> jacket. Yeah, you would like this one. Yeah, this is humongous. It's like, you know, just borrowing my boyfriend's jacket, but actually, I bought it myself. So it is long enough that it covers my shorts and just everything. You could basically wear this as a dress. Actually, not really. Your butt cheeks would hang out, but from the front, it covers a lot so it's like a zip up with a hoodie and I just really like it because I'm just gonna keep it in my locker for the whole year so whenever I get cold I can throw this on but as for now it is way too hot for that we don't have a dress code anymore really yeah wait sure. wait are you kidding me we don't have a dress code I mean you can't go naked or but yeah yeah yeah, yeah. Right. oh my goodness wait what is the dress code like can you show stomach like this does this are, offend you there's the last top I'm trying on. What do you think? Are you talking to me? Yeah. I think it's very nice. That sounded so fake. <laughs> so this shirt says chill since 1992? 3? And Tokyo. So they have a ton of these like chill since shirts and I got this one because I really like the color and I've literally never been to Tokyo so I'm kind of being a poser on this one but I just like the colors together a lot because pastel so maybe you'll see me in January wearing this but before then I don't think I'll be able to wear this this is the best dress I own right now and actually it's just like this so it makes you look super skinny if you want you can tie as tight as you'd like and I really like that because like if I eat then I can just go like that and it's all good and it's super like flowy it's a midi dress by the way and this top is super cute because you can just button it up like that or you can wear it like no yeah let's just button it up like that but i'd wear it with like pants or something because we're going a little too flowy right now the camera literally dead again so if you're wondering why there's a different type of lighting it's because i finally got home again let's just get right back into it so today i just wore this dress out because it was the next for the try on so so this is another one of the famous Brandy Melville wrap dresses. I love these ones, so I will always buy them whenever they have new prints that I like. And for this one, it's just this light blue stripe with this daisy print that looks embroidered, but it's actually fake. And they just use like puffy paint, but it looks really legit. And it is so comfortable and light to wear. Love it. So I never used to buy any Brandy skirts because they were always way too short that if i tried to like bend over it would just like be here you know like it's just unacceptable and i finally found a skirt that is such a good length like it's past my fingertips but just a little bit and it doesn't look motherly <laughs> and i really like that it hits a perfect part of my waist and it fits like so perfectly like the exact fitted the only thing is that since it fits me then that means it's not gonna fit someone who's smaller or bigger as well, which is something that's a bit frustrating that I found with brandy sizing because before this, I could never buy any of their skirts because they just didn't fit. And I love how this shirt matches this skirt perfectly. Since I love these skirts, I also got it in this green plaid. It's the exact same style. Just got this like light green plaid and I pair it with this lime green shirt that I just showed you guys and these two go together or these two go together and I just really like that little 
thing going on. I got so many questions about this shirt in my last video that I just posted. So it is from Brandy Melville and it has like the cutest little lavender butterfly. I've seen their orange butterfly, but I've never seen the purple one. So obviously I had to get this and I love how it like hits right here. It's pretty cropped, but I wear pretty high waisted things. So I think it is so cute and very, very flattering. So the next skirt that I really, really love is this purple one. I caught it in two other colors. I also got it in blue and in black because I love how this fits so much. Like, do you see? It's kind of like the other one that I showed you guys, except this one has a little bit more space, but still looks really good. This once again has that really perfect length. Ah, uh, the sun's going down, but we're just going to keep going because I don't want to try to film this tomorrow because school's starting. So, yeah, let's just keep going. And then I got a midi skirt. This one hits like right around here and it's definitely the loosest fit of the brandy skirts that I'm showing you guys. So the plaid one is the tightest, the solid short one was the medium, and this one I would definitely say is the most stretchy, except if you're smaller then it will fall down, so recommend the other ones. But for anyone who's my waist or bigger, I would recommend getting this skirt. These are these cream pants and I believe these are called like the Kim pants and I love the rise of these pants because they go like way past the belly button and they kind of just like make me feel a little bit more slim thick even though I definitely am not but these help me and I'm really happy to see that Brandy's one sizing is varying a little bit more now because before the one size meant just the XXS but now there is some pants that are definitely like medium or small or extra small because there's stuff that's just way too small for me or way too big for me which is nice to see so even though it's not a big change it is something and to finish off the clothing haul I'm going to show the most one size friendly pants that Brandy has so these are humongous as you can see but if I do the string extremely I can kind of make them fit and I had to get these because they're purple and this semester I feel like purples is going to be my color just because I got a purple backpack and you know we're just going to go with it so I feel like this is probably one of their most versatile pieces because truly it's pretty one size so these pants are pretty light and comfortable and it's like a really pretty little lavender color and they go full length they fit me pretty well and I am 5'3". Okay, that's it for this video. Thank you guys for watching the whole thing. Sorry the lighting got really nasty towards the end. Don't forget to follow me on my Instagram at kkatelee because I'm going to be posting pics and me styling these outfits and stuff like that. And don't forget to give this a thumbs up if you enjoyed these type of videos. I love doing clothing hauls. And I hope to see more if you guys like them. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button and turn on post notifications if you like to join our family. And you can be notified whenever I post another video. The shadows with this lighting is really bad. I just hold it like this. And also, since you guys always ask a video about working at Brandy, we'll be up soon. So, bye. See you guys later. Still drive me crazy.